no, I don't like how this is going. That's better. Welcome to the Left Coast. Tonight I've got a below average gaming. I've got uh, Tetris. I know I've been playing Mario vs. Donkey Kong lately, but I just feel like going retro tonight. I feel like playing some Tetris I haven't played in a long time. Um, I got some snacks. Uh, no big deal, just some leftover, the chocolate gummies. And I've got some of these uh, Starburst things from a little while ago. So I'm just going to eat some candy and play some video games. Anyway, let's get right into it. Okay, here we go. Tetris. Which music should I, or which, which music should I pick? That's a trick question. The answer is always A type. Start at level four. Okay, here we go. Let's just get right into it. It's been a minute. But I think I can do it. This controller is a little bit clunky. I've noticed. Um I like the I like the old original ones better. I feel like the response is better. This one that just sort of I don't know. I 
course it is. almost like it knew how to get me out of it. I know if anybody else has seen the uh, Tetris documentary. It's on Apple TV. I think it came out last year. Uh, it's really good. I knew that it was Tetris was created by a Russian guy, but I didn't know like the whole history of it. It's a crazy story. It's really interesting. The movie's really well done. Unfortunately, it's on Apple TV, so not everybody can watch it as easily. But if you want to bad enough, there's ways. Of course, I'm only talking about legal ways. Like going to a friend's house who has an Apple, a Apple account. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely, uh, definitely worth a watch. Even if you're not a gamer. interesting. It's, uh, Darren, uh, Edgerton, I think his name is. Is the, plays the lead. Anyway, it came out last year, so probably a lot of you have seen it anyway.
Gotta take what you can get sometimes, right? down anymore because it's going so fast. Just let it fall. Wow, that's a lot of force. It's not my best move, but it worked. Just click all the way through that A's because it's fast. Because the way the switch works with these retro games is unless you save it, the high scores all disappear anyway, so there's no point.
careful with those chocolate gummies because the chocolate's so rich it makes my throat itch and then I gotta get a drink or I'm gonna cough. We'll see, hopefully I, I don't have to. Oh, that sucks. Oh. Let's do that. Eventually, you play enough, and it just becomes muscle memory. I'm... I don't think I'm there. Although, it does somewhat come back from when I was a kid. Especially with this game. I played a lot of the... I played a lot of Tetris. because they're not overly sweet. There's a fly or something here. Okay, where's my floor? Might be a mistake, but I had to do something. Oh, I don't know. Oh, shoot. I thought I could get that in there, but I guess I can't. Oh well. This should, uh, mostly clear it up.
are getting candy now. It's too fast. with Nintendo's retro games because like we have the Switch and we have the whatever the online thing is and uh, all the games like well I shouldn't say all the games the one game that I wish they had that they don't is Blades of Steel and those of you that know what I'm talking about you know uh, but yeah, there's a bunch of Game Boy games, there's, now there's, uh, N64 games, and I was really excited the other night because I saw on the N64 emulator or whatever, on the, on the Switch, they have Goldeneye, and I wanted to play it so bad, and I was all excited, and I got it all set up, and went to play. And the controls are backwards. Like, looking is the right thumb. And walking is... No, the other way around. Looking is the... Is the left thumb. And walking is the right thumb. Which is backwards from what I remember. And I tried every different configuration in the settings. And I couldn't get it to... Couldn't get it to work. I tried even using the uh, Joy-Cons. This is, a, this is not good. I tried using the Joy-Cons and everything, and it didn't matter whatever I did. I couldn't get the controls to work right. So I ended up just, I wouldn't call it rage quitting, but I ended up just giving up. So I've still got my, N my actual N64, which I've played on the channel before, so if I want to play uh, GoldenEye, I just gotta get that out. I did have it on the shelf, but 
I think I got put in the closet. This is not. I'm talking again instead of playing. Oh, that was close. Oh, oh. Nope, not that. Okay. Anyway, it's getting late, so I'm gonna. Let relaxation take over. And until next time.